Now at six, a professional photographer who's made a career out of working in schools throughout Broward County is under arrest facing disturbing charges. Douglas Eaton is facing multiple charges of possessing child pornography, but even more alarming, he's accused of arranging to have sex with an underage girl. CBS 4's Joan Murray is live for us outside the jail in Fort Lauderdale where Eaton is being held tonight with more on the story. Joan? And Eaton has never been in jail before. He's been in business here in Broward County nearly 20 years photographing thousands of children. Ironically, on his webpage, he goes out of his way to say that he wants to protect children, and now he's accused of victimizing them. Mr. Eaton, you've been charged with uh, two counts of lewd and lascivious conduct with a uh, minor female. Prolific photographer Doug Eaton on the other side of the lens and now at odds with the law over allegations he had sex with a 15-year-old girl and had child pornography on his home computer. There were several images of children as young as eight. In addition, detectives have charged him for arranging with an escort service to bring a teenage girl to his home. He paid her $180. A pittance compared to the lucrative living Eaton has made on his well-established business known as Doug's Photography. A glance at his webpage shows he has photographed school kids, the anonymous and famous, like former Miami-Dade County Mayor Alex Pinellas and singer Gloria Estefan, even Broward's top cop, Sheriff Scott Israel, with his wife, kids, and pooch. And again, detectives have no indication that he has met any victims through that business. But the fallout has begun. The Archdiocese of Miami sending a letter to parents that reads in part, as you know, your child has participated in the teaching touching safety lessons. And I ask you to take this opportunity to discuss any experience with Mr. Eaton that would have made your child feel uncomfortable. And the Broward School District responding, upon being notified of his arrest, the district took action. Doug Eaton is no longer permitted to be used as a vendor with the district. Mr. Eaton was utilized as a photographer for a variety of events, including athletic games and competitions. I was kind of shocked. Neighbors at Eaton's Pompano Beach home say they believe he used his house as a studio for photographing models. And I know he did photography, uh, but not a lot of traffic with girls. Eaton's bond was set at $101,000 with a lot of restrictions. Obviously very, very early stages at this point in time. Next thing we're going to do is enter a not guilty plea and fight the allegations. Not a pretty picture tonight for Doug Eaton, who has lost a lot of business between the Catholic and the public schools here in South Florida. Again, he's pleading not guilty when he gets out. He is in the process of posting bond, and when he gets out, he's not permitted to be on a computer. He's going to have that GPS monitoring device, and the judge told him he cannot photograph any girl under 18 years old. Reporting live at the Broward Jail in Fort Lauderdale, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.